Okay, so in this video, I just want to talk about something that I find very important to talk about. So this video is dedicated to composers working in the media business, meaning like writing video game music, trailer music, licensed music, advertising, whatever. But also very important, aspiring composers that want to work for these kind of projects. And what I want to talk about, I'm observing on social networks, forums, basically everywhere. Also when talking with other composers directly. And there is actually this one little thing that puts so much pressure on so many composers. You know, so much that they start struggling getting their deadline done or trying to write their best piece ever, trying to not disappoint or even sneak in that extra bit that will, you know, blow everyone's socks off. So don't get me wrong here. I'm not saying that you should, you know, become lazy or you're not, not doing everything to write a great sounding track. You know, but sometimes it is just about building a table with four legs. Sometimes it's just about painting a room with white color. And that little thing that is sometimes so nagging is that we want to deliver the best work possible to impress other composers. And once you realize this, it can take actually away a lot of pressure. You know, of course, sometimes it's helpful when some other composers come in, especially other professionals, and give you some constructive criticism and some feedback, which I would always appreciate. And if someone likes your track, cool of course but if there are people saying that they would have done it differently because of whatever reason or even worse that someone thinks the style of music you're writing is not worth existing or insulting you even trying to talk you down so please do not make the mistake and care about these opinions i mean gamers and movie watchers they don't blame you for writing a full minor chord with a 12 trombone patch or even that the track you're writing just stays in the same key or maybe just using one chord if the client doesn't want woodwinds or even just synths only and no orchestra at all and you know in the end it's that producer or that director that having that vision of the video game or that movie and not another composer. So I hope you understand what I'm trying to bring across. Make the customer happy. Make the people consuming the end product happy. Generate more work and most important, fill up that bank account and lead a happy life. And think about this, everyone else who is just mocking you is probably just jealous of what you have achieved so far. Okay, so I hope I was able to motivate, inspire you a little bit. If you like this pretty short video, just give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. And as always, thank you for watching and happy composing.